about Dirty Tay getting jammed up for shooting a little boy in the head in the drive-by and people started coming at me well on reddit like I want to see little baby go down talking about Dirty Tay doesn't have anything to do with little baby now while little baby might not have anything to do with what dirty tay is being charged with in regards to that shooting dirty tay is 4 pf and it kind of reminiscent of the situation with ysl when christian barrage just shot the cop got locked up Subsequently, Young Thug gets hit with Rico charges. Gunner gets hit with Rico charges. 26 other members of YSL get jammed up with the Rico. So all I was trying to point out was with Dirty Tay getting locked up for allegedly shooting a little boy in the head. Three-year-old little boy in a drive-by trying to shoot the boy's father end up hitting the son he lived but I'm not sure of his condition that coupled with the fact that 4PF was already listed on the list of gangs in Atlanta that are being targeted um, by the Fulton County District Attorney's Office 4PF was listed Everybody has seen it. If not, I'll post it on this video. Said to be allegedly Crip affiliated for PF. So, what I'm saying is if, if Lil Baby has any vulnerabilities and if Dirty Tay has knowledge of any crimes that a little baby may be associated with may have knowledge of may have committed etc etc you better believe they're gonna put the full court press on Dirty Tay and as we can see in the YSL case most of these guys can't hold water so I'm just saying if that is the case if Lil Baby is vulnerable with Dirty Tay going down and for such heinous charges you know they're going to be showing him and talking to him about football numbers he's in there drunk right now you know he went from straight from the streets having a little cash in his pocket riding around pretty much doing whatever he wanted to do sitting in the jail cell looking at spending possibly the rest of his life or a large portion in prison and if you saw the video of his arrest he seemed to kind of know that he was going to be going away possibly for a long time so with that being said will he be able to hold water will he start talking if there is anything for him to talk about that's all I'm saying. 
Lil Baby is also closely affiliated with Lil Dirk. And we all know Lil Dirk is currently awaiting trial. Um, on an aggravated assault charge, weapons charges. He was involved in a wild shootout allegedly. Uh, right here in Atlanta. And um, I think he's also some armed um, robbery charges, but I'm not sure. Uh, King Vaughn was his co-defendant. As we know, King Vaughn uh, met his demise uh, last year. So Lil Durk is, uh, I believe, awaiting a trial alone. I'm not sure if there are any other um, co-defendants. Um, and it was just uh, also curious as to recently DJ Vlad posted a flashback featuring Lil Baby um, attesting to everything that he raps about being real. And you know, this to me kind of points out that, you know, Vlad might have some inside information or he might just be trolling. Uh, but I don't think he just trolls uh, willy nilly. Um, I believe he's operating possibly with some inside knowledge, some uh, background information that he doesn't tell. Um, the general public about and we know Fanny Willis is on the warpath um, after she said two more gangs were going to be named a couple of days ago uh, another gang uh, rich gang um, Rico charges dropped I believe it was 20 some odd members 25 26 members of the rich gang um, been going around committing home invasions armed robberies and shootings um, so they just fell a few days ago <clears throat> and you know so I'm just hoping little baby's moving uh, militant uh, keeping his nose clean he recently uh, gifted James Harden uh, 250k cash for his birthday and I just thought that was odd and maybe that's you know coming from a person like me um, without access to those types of resources uh, to just to gift a man you know $250,000 in cash um, kind of strange to me but hey to each his own but you know if the feds are watching and we know they are you know this might look a little crazy you know to give a man a quarter million cash for his birthday a man who's already a multi-millionaire you know what might the authorities think you know looking at a situation like this you know money laundering um was he paying money back uh you know, is he hitting middleman off for payment, you know, for undisclosed party? I don't know. I'm just asking questions. What's going on? You know, I just hope, uh, like I said, he's moving militant. I in no way, shape, form, or fashion um, want to see anybody fall, especially uh, if anything they haven't done. Uh, but again, as we all know, there are consequences for our actions and if we are here moving crazy and thinking that you know situations are not going to catch up to us um, you know you got to think twice you know information um, that's being transmitted uh, minute by minute you know to these people uh, they know a little bit of everything about you so if you are here moving crazy just understand that it could possibly come back to bite you. And if you're in a situation, um, you know, where you riding high on a hog, living high on a hog, you know, just think about what you stand to lose. You know, think about how far you've come and, and, and move better, you know, from this day forward. Just make a decision um, to move better, to move smart, and, you know, to think preservation. But that's it, you know. Your man online, Bill Money. Um, smash the like on this video. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, thanks for tapping in. I'll see you on the next video. I'm done with this one.